Send in those clever fiberglass tow trucks of yours. Uh-oh. Pay your back, Aloy. <laughs> this should stop those meddling Martian mice on a dime. <laughs> Pork rind pastrami and cream cheese bialy ain't sitting so well. Bro, bro, you make it in one piece? Yeah, basically. I don't know about my arm. I'm sorry, Moto. I'm afraid you're gonna need a new bionic arm. Hey, where'd you get this one anyway? You tell her. Okay, bro. Well, it was back on Mars, South Polar Country. Man, it was the biggest battle yet against the Plutarchians. We were captured and taken back to the Plutarchian research labs. Those slime fish bottom dwellers had a low life plan to turn captured Martians into an army of bionic slaves. Moto's arm was one of their early experiments. <laughs> I guess it worked a little too well. Better than those gill faces ever expected. Especially that Plutarchian's lapdog who made the arm. Carbuckle! 
You mean Carbuncle made Moto's arm? Shh, careful, sweetheart. <laughs> He's kind of touchy about that fact. I say we blast our way into Carbuncle's lab and force him to... Whoa, 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 chill, bro. Old rubber gloves are probably just booby-trapping. No, no, we need something smoother. Hey, no prob. I got me one of those surefire plans guaranteed to get our bro here a new arm. I mean, a real piece of cake. So smooth. I mean, so smooth you won't be able to stand it. If he says trust me, I'm out of here. I must think of another means to amass a monumental mound of metal. Hmm, what are we here? At this time tomorrow, the north line of the Chicago Elevated Train System will join the south line of the Waukegan Express at the new intercity train station to make one continuous commuter service between the two cities. The first two trains will come together at this very spot. Each train will carry its city's mayor, who will join together to drive the ceremonial iron spike. Two trains coming together, eh? Why, of course. Mm, it's perfect. Mm. We simply use Carbuncle's magnetic to a disruptor to magnetize and spike, causing a head-on collision between the trains. That would easily yield at least 5,000 tons of scrap metal. <laughs> How deliciously sinister. That's the main power supply. We're supposed to hook in this once a majiggy, and then tomorrow's we got ourselves a real pretty little train wreck. <laughs> train wreck? Why, those no good. Hey, one thing at a time, big guy. First we score you a new wing, then we do the hero thing. <laughs> yes, you do. Slide pit. It's your worst nightmare. <laughs> Richard Simmons and Mame? No, it's the nosy mousies. Okay. Initiate Operation Snag Me, and look like you mean it. Oh, darn. Stalled. Shit. Not used to firing Southpaw. Ha! <laughs> cool. Yeah! Time to kick it into overdrive. <laughs> Oops! Not reverse! No! Oh. <laughs> Catch it. Hey, this faking it is harder than the real thing. Yeah, well then let's put the capper on this act. I won! I won! I never win, but this time, I won! <laughs> and Mom said I should have finished third grade. She's gonna be so proud of her little garb of grease. <laughs> I won, I won, I won. <laughs> Suckers. Oh, thanks, Jolly Ma'am. <laughs> Right on schedule. Yeah, but I'll be working overtime trying to get Vinny's bike up to speed again. It got hammered pretty bad. We'll meet up later as planned, okay? Good luck with the bike, Charlie. I won, boss! I beat them bike roadies, boss! I won! I won! I won! Oh, everyone, I won! I won! I won! I won. You... You did? Why, that's absolutely astounding. Then that means you've also successfully installed the Magneto Disruptor. I won, I won, and everyone... Oops. Uh, <laughs> sorry, boss. Uh, I was so excited about beating the mice that I uh, kind of forgot to put in that Magneto thing, sort of. What? You oleagin us orangutan! Now those vermin will be guarding the station day and night! Uh, not all of them, boss. Cause I caught one of them all by myself. He's down at the docks lab right now. Oh, really? <laughs> please don't torture me! I'm not good with pain! No! Please! Don't make me tell you the biker mice secret weapon. My bros would never forgive me. <laughs> oh, my, my. Secret weapon. <laughs> yeah, the Moto's bionic arm. If you made robot arms like that for your goons, why, they could wipe the floor with us. <gasps> Oops. Oh, gosh. Now I've gone and said too much. Mmm, robot arms. Interesting. Of course, maybe Carbuncle's gotten too old and feeble-minded uh, to build anything that cool nowadays. 
Why, you simple-minded little sewer rat. I'll... I believe our overbiting friend here has provided an excellent idea. <laughs> oh, no! I just hate myself. <laughs> In fact, why stop at merely a robot arm? Why not build an entire robot mouse? Yeah! A whole mouse? Oh, no, 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 no! I didn't mean that. Oh, man, I think my plan needed a little more work. Behold! The Verminator. This should certainly give those fur-faced freedom fighters a fight if they should attempt to derail our magneto-disruptor. Excellent, my dear doctor. I don't think it's so hot. No. We just need one more tiny ingredient. You. Huh? Oh, man. Not cool. Oh, didn't I mention? How thoughtless of me. You see, through these electrodes, you will have the indubitable honor of supplying the Verminator's brain power. You see, the Verminator will have your skills, your brazenness, your memories, and even your personality. Ooh, such as it is, it will be everything you are and more, but filtered through Carbuncle's evil accelerator and totally under my control. <laughs> to install and some trains to demolish. Ceremonies marking the dedication of the new intercity commuter line are underway. The two trains have already left from the Chicago and Waukegan stations, each carrying its mayor. The trains will soon be coming together, right on this spot. Oh, how very right she is. And now that I's a winner, Mom, <laughs> I was thinking, maybe I'll get me a line of toys. Uh, how's this? Grease Pit's Dream House. Um, Pitsy's Prom Night. <laughs> or maybe even Greasy Spring Break. <laughs> or maybe just Grease the Home Game. Uh, uh, we's here for a good view of the trains. Hey, try this view, slime ball. <laughs> Warmed up. Ask and you shall receive, sweetheart. The Verminator's at your service. And I say, let's rock and roll! Now what the heck would that be? Well, offhand, I'd say it looks like your new mechanical arm, bro. There seems to be a whole new mouse attached. Yoo-hoo! Moto throttle! Ready to get trashed! Our, Our reputations obviously precede us. Price of fame, you know. Attack move 37A! Hey, that was our secret defense to 37A. Oh, Ma, that tin turkey knows what we're gonna do before we do it. Yeah, well, I'm taking him out. Oh, <laughs> I wouldn't do that if I were you. You see, any damage to our interesting little robot will instantly destroy the tiny little brain that's powering it. The brain of your hyperactive friend. Really? Hasta la vista, bros. <laughs> Just like Grim. Hey, listen, we need to think this one out, big fella, man. There's too much at stake. Not so fast, Verminator. Oh, what now? We'll finish off those vermin later. Report to Grease Pit for guard duty as planned. Oh, most blissful success. Finally. Those Martian menaces have been neutralized. Now, quickly, Doctor, install the Magneto Disruptor. Yes, your yogurty yumminess. Man, where is the action? Yeah, we're all wired up. 
The Magneto Disruptor is installed and ready, your cheese Danishness. Magnificent. Activate it, if you please. <laughs> At once. In a moment now, the mayors will arrive and drive the iron spike into the truck. I'm just finishing here. What's the plan? Hard to say, but we may have to hightail it as soon as we snatch Vinny. I'm on my way with his bike. Over and out. These fully automatic trains have been designed to operate at speeds of up to 80 miles per hour. Um, make that 90. Um, 95? 100? Uh-oh. Gotta be some way to get past Metal Mouse there and fry that machine. I heard that. But we gotta do something new. Something he's not expecting. But mainly, something that won't hurt our bro. Gotcha, gotcha. It's time to rock and add live. All right. And living just like a figure. Oh, it's Tail Whippy time! Oh, God. <laughs> That's Vinny, all right. Yeah, remember, just aim for the magnet machine, not the robot. <laughs> Pretty cool, eh? Well, at least it stopped his singing. Oh! Oh! oh, yeah! I'm one big old cute pile of style. Don't you just hate me for it? <laughs> <laughs> the sweet savor of success. This just keeps getting better and better. And now, dare I say it, annihilate them! Deja vu, we've been here before. Yeah, but this time it's for real. Charlie's not here and this is not my idea of a good time. Excitement builds as the trains are within sight of the station. <laughs> 30 seconds to impact. Later. Bro amigos. Don't do it, Vinny. We're bros. Family. Oh, man. I never thought it'd end like this. Being burned by our own bro. No. He's not dropping us. Maybe he forgot. Don't bring it up. Or maybe. Vincent. Vincent, it's us. Throttle and Moto. You're bros. My bros. Carbuncle, what's happening? Why is it hesitating? Why isn't it hurting someone? Perhaps a, a simple slight adjustment to the aggression circuitry, your uh, imitation dairy cream. Uh, oh. No. Uh, uh. Ch Charlie? Charlie. Hey, sweetheart. Vinny, listen to me. You're a sweet, kind, generous guy who could never hurt his friends. And there's no way that cabbage head carbuncle can make you. Carbuncle. Carbuncle. Carbuncle! Carbuncle! What is he doing? I said obliterate them, you mangy morass of metal! Do it at once! No! What? Betty! Hey, big fella. Let me give you a hand. <laughs> I guess once a bro, always a bro. <gasps> Oh, no! The trains are out of control! Oh, no. Not the usual failure. Look out! <laughs> I would suggest that we abort the mission at once. You petroleum pea brain! Chill, bro. Let him go. We gotta scope out Vinny. Oh, no. Hey, bros. Good to see ya. Do I get an Oscar or what? He's back. A call for Lawrence Limburger from High Chairman Cabin Bear regarding the overdue shipment of scrap metal. Hey, hey, Charlie girl. Do you think you could coax one more charge out of that Magneto thing? Come on, you have to ask. Machines are my life. <laughs> Observe. Limburger here to your mealy-minded, mega-egoed majesty, Kamen Bear. You may transport your scrap metal directly from Limburger Tower. You know, his acting really does stink. Oh, absolutely. Totally lacking in dimension. We give it a... Thumbs, thumbs down. down. Hmm. Everyone's a critic. Tower. 
my opulent oasis, my hallowed haven, where I can recuperate from yet another most miserable day. Why? 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 Uh, does this mean I didn't win? Oh, shut up. <laughs>